Hi, good day. First, let me introduce to you myself. I am Christine Rose Cacolba Agopra, a third year college student taking a Bachelor of Secondary Education major in Filipino in St. Judas College of Belize. So, do you want to get to know the mother of Philippine folk dances? She is Francisca Reyes Aquino. In today's video, we will be digging how she became the mother of the Philippines folk dances and how she sought and fought for our country's folk dances. So first, I will tell you what is folk dance. Folk dance is generally a type of dance that is um, vernacular which is usually recreational or a um, expression of past and present culture. It is a popular dance which is a part of a tradition or custom of a particular people. Many traditional dances are designed to thank the gods for the natural and agricultural um, events such as rain and harvests. The dances were performed during festivals and remembrances of the past military victories and is still performed in um, the celebrations of births and weddings in the modern times. Philippine folk dance mirrors the culture and tradition of the Filipinos. It has also been the source of culture identity of the people. So who is Francisca Reyes Aquino? On March 9, 1899, Francisca Reyes Aquino, the country's pioneer researcher on traditional Philippine folk dances and music, and known as the mother of Philippine folk dancing, was born in Lolomboy, Bukawi, Bulacan. Francisca was the eldest of the three children of Felipe Reyes and Juliana Santos. She had her early schooling at the Misaic Elementary School, Tondo Intermediate School, and Manila High School in Tondo, Manila. She obtained her high school teacher certificate in 1987, her Bachelor of Science in Education degree in 1924 at the University of the Philippines and her Master's of Arts degree in 1926 also in the University of the Philippines. As early as 1921 to 1923, Francisca began her search for folk dances to use in the classes while a student assistant in physical education. She traveled to remote barrios in central and northern Luzon. In 1924, she became an assistant instructor. She quickly saw that with further impact of Western culture, many dances would be lost for extensively modified. She continued gathering folk dances, songs, and games for her master's thesis at the University of the Philippines in 1926. She revised her work in 1927 and published it as a Philippine folk dance and games. In this and later collections, the great diversity of dance, type, tempo, and music reflected a many faceted Filipino character. In 1921, during the Manila Fiesta Carnival, Reyes Aquino, who was a student assistant for physical education, presented four dances, the Carinosa, Abaruray, Salabat, and Ariwana. In 1947, she married Serafin Aquino, Secretary Treasurer of the Philippine Amateur Athletic Federation, an enthusiastic collaborator in presentation of his wife's work. That same year, Francis Reyes Aquino became the Superintendent of Physical Education, Bureau of Public Schools, Philippine Republic. She was awarded as a Doctor of Science degree in the Physical Education Honoris Causa from the Boston University and in 1959, a Doctor of Humanities Honoris Causa from Far Eastern U University in Manila, Philippines. She is the author of seven books and numerous articles. In 1949, Dr. Reyes Aquino founded the Philippine Folk Dance Society to bring together physical education students teachers, administrators, and individuals interested in folk dancing. In the 1940s, she served as supervisor of the physical education at the Bureau of Education that distributed her work and adapted the teaching of folk dancing as a medium of making young Filipinos aware of their cultural heritage. In 1954, Dr. Reyes Aquino received the Philippine Republic Award of Merit for her untiring efforts in collecting 
compelling and propagating folk dances and for her outstanding contribution to the advancement of the Filipino culture in the field of dance. Other awards include Cultural Award in UNESCO of the Philippines in the Rizal Pro Patria Award, Certificate of Merit in Bulacan Teachers Association, the Ramon Magsaysay Award, and an award for Outstanding Alumna, College of Education, University of the Philippines. The sum of the major works of Francisca Reyes Aquino. Here is a phrase from Francisca Reyes Aquino that we must remember. According to her, heritage must not be sacrificed for progress. What matters for now is for every Filipino to protect our tradition and let no one distort it under the guise of modernization.